doing this the rest of the day. All right, guys, what up? Welcome back to the channel. We are at our first spot here fishing USA Bassin, uh, the Spring Division. It's the first tournament of the Spring Division. Uh, just made a pretty long boat run. Gonna fish some down here towards the dam more. Uh, try to get on some big fish and then we're gonna make a move and try to uh, get on some fish shallow. It's gonna warm up today quite a bit. So we're gonna go find some shallow or dirty water and hopefully that water's warmed up and we can get on some big fish shallow. So that's the plan today, throwing around jerk baits, typical type stuff to begin with, and then probably pick up a crank bait and maybe even a spinner bait, throw it up shallow. So that's the plan, see if we can get it done today. Huh? Oh yeah. Should be some decent amount of brush too, remember? So hopefully we don't get hung up in it. Yeah, there's that brush pile. That one? So he's good. You can go to the first spot. First spot, you're already catching him. Spot? Oh, no. God, he's marked up like it. I, he's, I think it's just got in the winter time or something. I don't think he is though. That's positive. There's one. Hey. Little. All right, we're finding a couple of fish. Dude, he freaking smoked it. He wasn't on there when I jerked it. I went to jerk it like on the second jerk and he hit it while I was like jerking it. Beating the hell out of this jerk bait. There's one. Yep. Can't, I think he's think he's little. Yeah. Oh, that's a Kentucky. That's a spotted bass for sure. Yeah. That's for sure. You can definitely tell by the jawline. Yeah, you can see his. You can tell by his mouth and everything. Uh, what are you looking for? Where are we at? Measuring board. Under all my bullshit. 12. Oh, yeah. 14. First keeper, guys. Little spotter. I'm gonna stick this one on a cold tag. Do I have a cold tag? Yeah. One. Yeah. Hopefully we get rid of him. Are you gonna put him in that side? Yeah. You got some other ones too, on the other side. Yeah. Remember I put those ones in there, those Rapala ones or whatever they are, the red ones? They're not, I don't think they're the best, but. They grow sometimes. Well, as soon as we hopped over to a more gradual bank, we caught one. He was up there pretty far, wasn't he? That's a spot, but he ain't 12.
Nice. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, look at him. Look. Oh, he turned around, bro. No. <laughs> bro. <laughs> you see how you just drop it on their head and get him? Yeah. Damn. He's still there. Go down, go down, go down. Missed him. He's just swimming along. They like this little single swimmer if you get it right on them. Little crappie hit it. That's the first time, right when I say I never caught a crappie on it. Big one? Oh. See, yeah, I seen him for a second. Pretty surprising. Uh, I'm getting nice and toasty though. I told you you have them mixed in there. That bass is mixed right in with this crappie. That was sweet. Right off those poles, weren't they? Yeah, that is. Right where they were last time, right here. That's where I caught my big one. Yeah, it's definitely a spot. That's where I caught my big one. I caught a couple of it last weekend. Yeah, you hook them sideways, they'll start cartwheeling on you. They feel, they feel big, dude. Spotted bass limit. Second keeper, guys, got two little spots. There's one. It's a good one. No. Oh yeah. There we go. Good call. Dude, I was sitting there with Slackline, he just took off with it. Did you just have one? No. Oh, I broke one of my hooks off. One of my front hooks. That make a best? Yeah. Dang. Could have did it when I was at that cage. I don't know. Go guys, this one should keep. Yep, it's about 15 and a half. Here we go guys, we got three. He was up there, dude. Big fish in front of you. There's one. Oh my god. I didn't know that was a fish, bro. 
I thought I was on the bottom. I set the hook on him, let slack. I'm like, wait, that was a fish. And then started bringing him in. God damn it. I'm an idiot. That was my fault. There we go, baby. Oh, well, we're doing this the rest of the day. I don't think we wasted time either where we were. Hey, jump on the troll motor. What? Let me, I'll take care of the fish. You got the troll motor. I don't think we wasted time doing what we did either. I bet these fish didn't move up till now. Dude, you had them hooked to top of the head. big one dude <laughs> well, I guess I could have got that for you I think we've seen a couple of those down that bank one I lost was that was he up shallow there's one oh my god look at that swirl five pounder Five f***ing pounder, dude. God. I wasn't even pulling him that hard. He came up so quick. I hate jerk baits, dude. All right, guys. Back to where we caught those ones just a little bit ago. Went and tried some dirty water. Did not work out too good. <laughs> oh, it's a good sign, but. I was like, you're shitting me. Giants. <laughs> Four in there. Yeah. Hey, that water's cold. Good luck, buddy. Yeah. Seven, ten. How many fish here? Five. Is that any for big? Oh, uh, no. Oh, 
Jim coming back and going for total weight. Ten thirteen. y'all right, that's gonna do it for today's tournament video uh, all in all pretty good tournament uh, found some fish got on fish I think it was JC's second cast he literally hooked into one on that second cast and caught a few in that area uh, ran to a, a little bit different of a spot sort of the same area caught fish the whole time we were there uh, <clears throat> then decided to make a run towards another about 30 minutes away so Ran down there, caught fish there, ran to another different, ran to some muddy water, and then we ended up not catching anything in the muddier water. We're throwing cranks and spinners and jerk baits and stuff up super shallow, thinking that we can make it, maybe catch some fish pulled up super shallow in that dirty water. It was definitely a lot warmer, but couldn't make it happen. Didn't want to burn the rest of our tournament there, so we ran back to some more clear water and caught a couple more. Uh, caught fish all day, like I said. We uh, we had the bites to cash a check too. Uh, if you're looking at the tournament weights and stuff, I lost that. Uh, I said five pounder. I'm gonna say it was a four to six pounder. I mean, I seen that somewhere right around in there, so that would have bumped us up. Obviously, you've seen some of those uh, little bitty spotted bass that we had, so definitely would have been a big coal. Would have been like a three to five pound coal, probably. So, uh, I mean, some of those spots probably two of those spots probably didn't even hardly even weigh a pound, so uh. Would have been a big jump there so it definitely would have been in the check line and made a little bit of money had i landed that fish uh, also missed one that i showed you guys in the video and i think i didn't put the other one in there but i had another one pull off too that felt pretty dang solid so did not fish clean jc did but i did not lost that big one and uh had two others pull off so and i was right there in the same area where jc caught his big one and i lost the big one so i mean there could have been two other good sized fish we're seeing a bunch on the live scope uh <clears throat> running down big bait fish out there so i wouldn't be surprised if they were all big ones that is going to do it for today's video thank you guys for watching and uh down below hit that subscribe for me hit, hit the like share and uh Next video you guys will be seeing, finally getting back on the river, doing some fishing. Met up with Aaron Click, and uh, we went, did, did a little bit of cranking, testing out the new uh, crankheads. They've been out for a little while, but threw those around. Haven't got the chance to throw them around a ton, so we went through those around quite a bit, and I ended up catching quite a few fish. Caught one real nice one. Aaron caught a nice one, and uh, it was just good, a good little evening of fishing there. So look forward to that video and then uh, i'll have a bunch more tournament videos coming up soon for you guys and along with should be getting in the creeks very very soon i know you guys have been asking for those videos uh but yeah a lot of videos coming and i thank you all for watching